I'm Andrew Edwards and you're watching Gear Live. If you're into PC gaming, building PCs, or just love tinkering with your system, one name that you should get familiar with is SK Hynix. At CES 2020, SK Hynix announced new NVMe SSD products that are some of the fastest that you'll find from anyone in the platinum and gold P31. The company also recently shipped the 2.5 inch SATA Gold S31 SSD as well. And in this episode, I give you the full rundown. What is going on Tech Squad? Andrew Edwards here, editor in chief of GearLive.com. And as I mentioned today, we are talking about SK Hynix, one of the world's leading manufacturers of SSDs and flash storage. We've got a couple of new products to talk about that were just announced back at CES 2020, along with this guy right here. This is the SK Hynix Gold S31 2.5 inch SATA SSD. But before we jump into the products themselves, let me give you a primer and some background on who SK Hynix is. SK Hynix actually controls about 23% of the memory market and they've been doing this since 1983. In fact, they're one of the top semiconductor companies in the world and a lot of the popular brands and OEMs that you've probably heard of use SK Hynix chips. So what I mean by that is if you were to open your computer right now and pull out a RAM stick and remove the heat spreader and read the chip, there's a good chance that that chip is gonna say, SK Hynix on it. And aside from RAM, that also applies to other NAND technologies like SSDs. So SK Hynix has been a trusted name in the space for some time now, to the point where other OEMs buy SK Hynix products and then slap their name on top of it. But now SK Hynix is back in the direct to consumer market, which means they're not just selling to OEMs anymore. They're also selling to people like me and you, the average consumers. That brings us back to CES 2020, the biggest, consumer electronics trade show in the world happens every year in January in Las Vegas. SK Hynix was there almost as like a coming out or a coming back party to the consumer market. The company was showing off a few of its newest consumer products. Specifically, we've got the Platinum P31 NVMe SSD, the Gold P31 NVMe SSD, and again, the recently released Gold S31 SSD. Now I'm going to have another video in the future taking a closer look at these products, but in this video I want to break down what you can expect from these SSDs, why you might want to choose them if you're building a system or if you're upgrading or if you're just looking to expand the storage in your PC or Mac. So let's start off with the newer products, the SK Hynix Platinum and Gold P31 NVMe SSDs. These are SSDs in the NVMe form factor built with the company's proprietary technology, which includes the world's first 128 layer NAND flash manufacturing process to enter mash production, as well as the hyper write technology that makes sequential write speeds even faster using SLC buffer. Now, when it comes to real world performance, that is where these drives shine and actually outshine the competition. Starting with the Platinum P31 NVMe, you're looking at a 128 layer consumer SSD in the highest capacity that SK Hynix offers, that being two terabytes of storage. That's alongside best in class speed, offering 3,500 megabyte per second read speeds and 3,200 megabyte per second write speeds, all wrapped up in one of the highest endurance drives you'll find out there. The Platinum P31 supports 1,500 terabytes written or TBW. What that means is that this drive will support 1,500 terabytes being written to it. That is highly durable. In fact, if you wanna put that in perspective, you can write 100 gigabytes per day, every single day to the Platinum P31 for 42.1 years before you hit the 1500 terabyte mark. Now on top of all that, SK Hynix also gives you a five year warranty. So if something goes wrong, you are covered. Now I did mention that there is the Platinum P31, but there is also the Gold P31 NVMe as well. And that one has just a couple of differences when compared to the Platinum. First up, while I mentioned the Platinum P31 is two terabytes in size, the gold model is available in 500 gigabyte and one terabyte sizes. So if you need something larger, you're gonna to wanna to choose the Platinum model instead. Now, the other main difference is that the gold P31 is rated at 750 terabytes written 
rather than 1500. So again, very durable. That would be the equivalent of writing 100 gigabytes per day, every day for 21 years. Everything else about the drives is the same, including the speeds and including that five-year warranty. Now, finally, there is the SK Hynix Gold S31 SATA SSD. This one is built for both speed and value. The Gold S31 uses 3D NAND and hits 560 megabyte per second read and 525 megabyte per second write speeds. SK Hynix says that the Gold S31 SSD is rated for 600 terabytes written. And using the same analogy from earlier, that would mean writing 100 gigabytes per second every day for 16 years. Now this one right here is a great drive for someone looking to build a system who's looking for something faster than a spinning hard drive, but also doesn't wanna break the bank. Also, if you're a gamer or content creator and you just want a fast drive, but an NVMe is out of your budget, the Gold S31 is gonna be your best bet. Now, if you wanna pick up the SK Hynix Gold S31 SSD, it is actually available right now. And you can pick it up at 256 gigabytes, 512 gigabytes or one terabyte sizes. Alternatively, if you're interested in the platinum and gold P31 NVMe SSDs, those will be coming later this year with pricing to be announced alongside the launch. But there you have it guys, that was your look at the new SSD products, consumer products from SK Hynix. But now I wanna hear from you guys. What do you think? Are you into upgrading your computer? Do you tinker around inside? Do you do your own upgrades? Do you just buy new computers when you need them? And for all you gamers out there, have you switched over to SSDs to take advantage of the much faster speeds that they give us? Let me know down in the comments below and I will meet you there for further discussion. If you wanna hear more about CES 2020 in general, be sure to subscribe to the Geared Up podcast. Geared Up is the podcast that I do each and every week with John Rettinger, where we bring you the latest in tech, games, and of course, consumer electronics and gadgets. Head to your favorite podcast player and search for Geared Up in order to subscribe. And speaking of subscribing, don't forget to hit the subscribe button right here on this channel if you wanna stay up to date on all future video releases. Until next time, thanks so much for watching as always, guys. I appreciate your support. I'm Andrew Edwards, and I will catch you in the next video.